mean to you? That means a lot. Um, you know, growing up with not much, you know, my parents did what they could, so I know what it feels like to to need but be afraid to ask. So I try to take initiative and kind of give back to those who I feel like are in need. Was that a specific goal of yours this year, Mark, and to try and kind of do extra? Um, it's I wouldn't say this year. It's always been a, a goal of mine. I, I kind of do things under the radar every year. I kind of just, I guess, I mustered up enough courage to let the world see it. So um, it's something I've been doing forever. But I just decided to let the world into my world and show them what I do in the community. Why? Um, just to kind of give people encouragement to go out and do the same. I feel like a lot of people want to give back and want to help. They just don't necessarily know how to do it or what to do. Um, so I guess that gives them a little push or a little nudge to go out and do something. From a team perspective, why do you feel it's important as a group for you guys to be out in the community and helping others? Because um, it's, not, it's not about me. Um, I feel like the more people you bring along with you, the more you can get done. I've, obviously, I could do it on my own, but I feel like you can you can impact more people by bringing a couple people, a couple guys along, and you know, long after I'm going, they probably could carry it on too. So, there's a long list of Stampeders who have won this award, have done some great things. Mm -hmm. Your name's now part of that. Has that kind of sunk in? And, and, and do you understand like the meaning behind that Herm Harrison award? Um, no, nah, it hasn't really sunk in. Cause honestly, I I don't really do it for the awards. I just do it because I love to do it. It feels good, you know. So, with the award, it kind of Adds a little bit more, but it hasn't sunk in yet. Yeah. To events at hand, uh, you know, it's a different circumstance for you being here. Three games that don't have a playoff impact. Your approach and how do you feel the team's responding this week? Same approach as every week, win. Um, we're not thinking about nothing past this game. We don't think about anything in the past. Just go out there and play as hard as you can and give it your best and get it done. How important is it for, on top of that question, how important is it to kind of show some of the rookies and some of the young guys who might not necessarily know how to handle a situation like mm -hmm. this and, and be a professional? Um, it's very important, man, because adversity doesn't just happen on the football field. It happens in life. So, um, you know, I guess being one of the older guys kind of shows them that, you know, regardless of what you're going through, you got to put your best forward and give everything you got. I talked to Cam about this real quick. Uh, you know, obviously playoffs are on the horizon. However, this could be a good catalyst for what you want to do in 25. How important is that for you and, and, and kind of echoing those sentiments? Uh, most definitely, man. Um, you know, like I said before, uh, we don't, we don't, we don't, we're not thinking past this game. Um, we still got to go out there and compete. And it, you got to show your character, man. You can't be somebody who gives up when things, when you feel like there's nothing to play for. Um, but there's always something to play for because you never know when your last snap's going to be. So you got to go out there and give everything you got.